And the guy wouldn't let up. Every time he got the pulpit, he'd make some little joke. And I started getting a feeling. And it wasn't this feeling. You know what I'm saying? I was getting a little annoyed. And I started getting angry. And when I did that, I started hearing the wings of the dove start to leave. And I said, whoa, 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 whoa. The anointing is much more important than my feelings. The anointing is much more important than somebody embarrassing me. We've got to learn how to check ourselves so the dove will remain. How many understand what I'm saying? How many can see an area in your life that's causing you problems keeping the dove remaining? Can anybody relate? How many can see an area? How many want to be covered up in the mantle? You've got to go to an oil press. You've got to crush that part of you that's grieving the Spirit. That's the price you got to pay. It's right here. All the Spirit is looking for is somebody to crush. Somebody that will crush the pulp so the pure oil can cover them. In just about three minutes, there's going to be a group of people here that are bringing that part of them down and the anointing is going to cover them like never before. Those areas you said you could tell that was grieving the Spirit, bring them right here and let them be crushed right here. And the pure oil is going to cover you like never before. Come right now, quickly. Anybody want it? Anybody want it? Anybody want it? Anybody want it? What is that area that's causing the Spirit to be grieved? Let the power of the Holy Ghost fall on me. Fall on me. Anointing. Fall on me. Anointing. Fall on me. Let the power of the Holy Ghost fall on me, hey, anointing fall on me. Come on, go to the oil press. Anointing.